Hey everybody, welcome back for another snuff review. Today, we're going to be trying out Superior Scotch Snuff. Now this is a Swisher product. You might be able to see it right there. And this is an American Snuff, obviously, but it's a... Uh, <laughs> may cause mouth cancer. Uh-huh. Hmm. Not sure about that one. <laughs> anyway, this is a 1.15 ounce container. Measured in ounces, not grams, because it is an American snuff. And naturally, the United States got to be different from everybody else. But whatever. Anyway, the thing that I don't like much about this type of snuff uh, regardless, let's see if I can find the daggum camera here, there we go, is the container, uh, the way it's put together, because this just kind of slides off, see there's no threading, oops, where is it, no threading, no nothing on it, there's a little plastic lip on there that's supposedly supposed to hold the lid in place, well, it does alright I guess, it just, it's not my favorite kind of a container. I'll just say it that, okay? Now, tin note on this. Again, very fine snuff, very fine grind, so you gotta be careful when you sniff it. Now this actually smells darker, is the only real word I can come up with, than the uh, Navy Sweet, which is also put out by Swisher. But you can, you can, smell a definite darker uh, flavor to it. To be honest, actually, it actually smells a little bit like mesquite wood chips, if that makes any sense. Yeah, a real mesquite flavor to it, or scent to it, out of the tin. Now, the color on this, see if I can tip it up without spilling it everywhere. See, it's a kind of a medium brown. Uh, again, it looks a little bit darker in the camera oops, than it does in person. But it's a darker color brown. Very fine grind. Let's see if I can get it up here very fine grind. It clumps together a little bit, so there is some moisture in there. More than I had anticipated when I bought this stuff, like I said about the other. But, see? Spoon is at 90 degrees, and it's still on the spoon. But it does fall off after a bit. But, so the moisture is very low. Okay, very low. Not totally like bone dry but it is very low and very very fine grind so the time has come <laughs> let's take a pinch take a pinch with me if you're of the mind to always enjoy having friends that'll take a snuff with me little pinch there Again, you got to be very careful with this, very fine grind, so it'll shoot clear back to your throat and down into your lungs if you try to really snort it. So, very gentle pressure. Okay, last little bit went a little far. I felt like I was trying to hurry myself a little. Yeah, look at that nose mascara. All right, now, this does have a little bit of a burn. Not too bad. I would say medium mild, yeah, 
mild, medium, medium, mild, however you want to say that. Same basic thing. It's not bad. You can feel a little bit of a persistent burn back there. Uh, that'll be the nicotine working on you. Now, once in a while with this, I will warn you, I get a little bit of a back drip. And it's not the best tasting, but it's not too bad either. I mean, a little bit of water, coffee, soda, whatever, it'll wash it right down. Um, now, in the nose, that, that mesquite scent gets a little more potent. I mean, it, it really does come out really strong. Uh, it's almost to the point of being an overwhelming scent, but not quite. But that is pretty much the entire scent. Just that very, uh, very strong mesquite type scent. It's pleasant, don't get me wrong. Um, but it is, it is a bit more potent than, than I normally like. And it persists for a good long time, you know, 10 minutes, maybe 12. Uh, as usual, once you take it, if you, if it starts to die down and you go outside, it's going to last, I mean, it'll come back full force for maybe two or three extra minutes. But it is, it's a nice scent, just very potent. Uh, very, yeah, it's, it's there. Now, nicotine on this is fairly high. Uh, it's probably medium high to maybe high uh, on my scale. Um, it, it definitely satisfies the craving. And you start feeling kick in. Now, with me, usually I'll take a pinch like I just did. And then about two, three minutes later, I'll take another pinch. Uh, that's kind of how I do snuff now and it's mostly because my nicotine intake has gone way up um, but the nicotine on this is actually it's pretty good uh, like right now I can still feel the throbbing in my nose a minute or so after I uh, finish this video up I'll take another pinch just to to finish off my craving uh, but my overall rating for superior, if I can find the camera, superior scotch snuff made by Swisher. I would say that this is a 9 out of 10. Uh, like I said, the scent is very potent, but to me, of course, I, I love barbecue. So to me, that mesquite scent, just for some strange reason, even as potent as it, as it is, it, real, it really appeals to me. So um, I don't know. Maybe it's the American in me. <laughs> anyway, Superior Scott Snuff. 9 out of 10, I would definitely suggest you uh, trying it out if you can find it. It's not very easy to find. Uh, I got this off of Mr. Snuff, uh, this and my other Swisher product, uh, but I haven't found it on Mr. Snuff since. And it's... If you can find an American outlet or whatever, it, it'd be a lot easier for you to deal with because it took forever to get here uh, using uh, Mr. Snuff. Not just the standard 10 days for the rest of their stuff, but because of how they probably have to order it, mm, third-party order, blah, 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 blah. It took a long time to get here, like three weeks. So... If you can find an American distributor for this, for all I know, you guys can all pick this up at your local corner store, corner mart, whatever. Um, I can't up here where I am, but, you know, that's just how it goes. But, 9 out of 10, and a very good snuff. If you're a beginner, be very gentle. Remember your, uh, your nasal uh, insufflation control. It's, you have to be very gentle, or it will shoot straight to your sinuses, or to the back of your throat, potentially down to your lungs. To your lungs, very bad idea. But, it's a very good snuff, and I suggest everybody try it, because 
it's it's real nice and it's it appeals to you on a, kind of a strange level to be honest but it, it is good all right everybody you all have a good day hope everything's going great for all of you